back to Bill Jordan's Real Tree Outdoors. You know what, you kind of put us at a disadvantage. You've already got a nice deer. Well, uh, I don't know about the disadvantage, but I did get a nice deer. I really enjoyed it. Uh, my first hunt in Texas. Uh, uh, I didn't really know I was coming until Dale come up to me at the racetrack the other day and he <laughs> says, I'm picking you up at 5 o'clock Saturday morning. He said, you'll be at the airport. Well, I got to give you a little secret right here. We were here last year about the same time, Dale and I, and out of his mouth he said, you know what, we got to get Marcus here. We got to bring me to got to bring Marcus. Oh, thank you, Dale. Hey, yeah, this it, is a nice place. Jay Timmons. Really Jay Timmons does a great job down here. The deer are great. Uh, a, lot of, a lot of fun hunting. A lot of good food, too. And this man right here eats a lot. <laughs> Excellent food, I'll tell you. Now, the cook, he did a great job uh, cooking breakfast, cooking a noon hour meal in the evening. He, we've had good food. Excellent. Well you, well, you get a chance to sit around now while he and I hunt yeah. since you've got a nice deer. But i got to ask you a question. And, and Dale brought this up, up the other night at dinner. Neither one of you know I'm going to ask you this. But back in 1979, remember that the other night? Did he give you, did you give, a little tap back to him. It's, I know I that's a, not I done. I know I that's a, not done. I was a rookie in 79 and I got a lesson in racing right then. <laughs> I was a little rough on Dave's sheet metal when I passed him and he was a little rough on my bumper after I got past him. <laughs> I was sort of spinning down the back straightaway. It taught me, taught me a great lesson in life and I've had a lot of you respect. You remembered all these years, haven't yeah, you? I've got a lot of respect for Dave Marcus. Well, you know what I mean? He was hammering my car and I have to work in my own car so I wasn't too happy about that. <laughs> and and uh, yeah, I did hit him a little bit, and he spun. But uh, uh, Dale and I've been great <laughs> friends ever since. I think that that he knew that uh, you know I, I took care of myself. I had to stand on my own ground, and, and he does the same. And and he come to me. Uh, it was quite some time later, not right away, but he said, you know, I respect you for that. He said, my father taught me to take care of problems when you got them, get them handled, get them out of the way, and go on about your business. And uh, he said, I respect you for that. And Dale and I have been good buddies ever Mutual since. Mutual respect. Yeah. Well, I tell you what, it's been a lot of fun hunting with you guys. And I got to go get a big deer. Yeah, I got to outdo him, man. Hey, I, you, I, I've seen lots of deer every day. You guys won't have a problem. Just hang in there, <laughs> keep hunting, you get one. Well, we're going to have a bite for lunch, and uh, now it's our turn to see if we can go shoot a deer. And uh, Me first. Well, you first, you're the guest. So uh, we'll be right back.